I remember distinctively the very first time I fired up a camera with my friend Brian McKenna. What's up? I'm ready. And I fell in love with the process of making a video. Today we're going to talk a little bit about uh, my Kickstarter campaign. That Kickstarter campaign ultimately failed, but it it ignited something in me. A year later, I quit my day job. Well, today is a bittersweet day as it's my last day at the bank. I'm not going to miss the job, but I miss the people. This guy in there like that. And I thought, well, as I'm raising capital for this brewery, yeah, there we go. let's do another Kickstarter campaign. We'll do it one more try. Hi, everybody. My name is Steve Albers, and this is my crowdfunding campaign. And in 2016, I thought, okay, if I'm going to learn this process, I need to practice. So I'm going to set out to daily vlog for 30 days. I ended up going 300 in a row, and I loved every ounce of it. It's birthday, boy. Happy birthday, October 27th. Look who's here. Hi, buddy. But it all came crashing down. Um, around that time, I got a phone call from one of my best friends. His name's John Ferraro. And he says, hey, Stevie, I've got a lump on my leg. I'm going to go get it checked out, but just wanted you to know. It turned out to be an aggressive cancer. For three years, he fought like a warrior. I remember him telling me not to let it bother me. So I pushed on with the brewery. And ultimately when he passed it, it rattled me really bad. It was the first time I've ever experienced real grief. That was four years ago. And I, I think I'm ready to, to start creating again. I, I love this process. And there are some creators out there that I just love the way they tell stories. Kind of like the, the, the Ted Lasso effect. Lasso has this unbelievable tone and story that, that, that makes you feel good when you watch it. Barbecue sauce. I would love to aim to have that same effect on this channel. So I'm gonna start sharing some of my passions, some of my stories. I, you know, some of my passions are hockey and brewing beer and mixing cocktails and tech and filmmaking, vlogging, storytelling. I, I love these things. Center Ice Brewery opened in 2017 and it's been a roller coaster to say the least. That we are signing the lease at 3120 Olive St. Patrick's Day 2020, we have decided to temporarily close the tasting room. And for 2020 and 2021, we survived. But then our five-year lease came up. Unfortunately, our sales never really rebounded, and I was forced with a tough decision to move out of our facility and not renew the lease. So to keep things going, we partnered up with Charleville Brewery to contract brew our beer, and here we are today. 2023. As I launch this channel, I'm going to help a dozen friends of mine as well with trying to launch some social media content. You didn't know that? Iron Butterfly? Seriously? Oh, for real? <laughs> Your director's a dumb <laughs> You go for how long? Duration? Total duration? Honestly, I have no idea where this is going to go, but I'm going to give it my all. It's something I love to do, and let's see where it takes us.